This episode is a compilation of every single one of our episodes from our England tour, which was metal detected in England for 10 days. If you're already caught up on the saga and you've already seen days one through eight, fast forward to the two hour and 12 minute mark to see days nine and 10. Or you can watch the whole thing for the full experience, but this is it. I have no more England footage. And as always, thank you for watching. On with the show. England. Metal detecting in England. Long before I posted anything to YouTube, I watched a ton of YouTube. One of the channels I watched a ton of was Dr. Tone's 24K. I used to watch so much of his channel, my kids used to headbang to his intro. The clip always cracks me up. The baby in that video is actually my six-year-old now. So Brandon had a tour set up through metal detecting holidays and he had two more spots to fill. So he reached out to Brad and I. Now metal detecting in England is something that Brad and I have always talked about doing. But first we had to clear it with our wives that we were going to take off a few weeks of work, spend thousands of dollars, travel all the way to England to go metal detecting. The good news is Brad and I both married amazing women and they're both like, yeah, go. So we did. This week on the Hoover Boys. What are you over here giggling about? Smiling because I got one over here. You got one over oh, here, huh? That's great. Stop. Okay, we need to change it up a little bit. This is England. <laughs> England, yeah. day one. Wow. We made it. It's beautiful. Oh boy. Let's go find stuff. I don't know where to go. Everywhere. <laughs> yeah. First find, fired musket ball. How old? I have no idea. But I just flipped out a coin. So let's see what that is. It's little. We're out of our comfort zone. Oh, I thought it was a memorial at first. <laughs> Rubbing the zinc in? I have no idea. Did you get Roman? Uh, no. It, it looks modern. We'll put that in the pocket. What's that be? I don't know. It's the base of a uh, dagger. Congratulations. <laughs> yeah, thanks so much. <laughs> so Nathan's on the board very early. Three coins so far. Really? Yeah. His first Just Roman. Two, two moderns and then my first Roman. And I've never held one straight out of the field like this, ever. Wow. Oh, it's big! Oh, what a meaty mama! Hey, can, can we swipe that and figure out numbers and stuff? Yeah, uh, it no, can't. No, I'm, I'm saying over here. Oh, yeah, yeah, sure. What's, so the, what's the... It's an absolute banger. Oh, wow, 80-something? Yeah. <laughs> okay, congratulations. Thank you so much. That's Huge cool. congratulations. A big, fat Roman... <laughs> Game on. Game on. <laughs> Well, we did have sort of a little wager for the first hammered silver of the trip. Five pounds each. Oh, yeah, buddy. And, uh, yeah. Apparently, TJ's first in the board. Oh, it is. Oh, it's beautiful. Yeah, it's all right. So, what's the uh, age on this? 1300, 1350. 1300s. 13, 27, 13, 77. There you go. That's the one Congratulations. I, <laughs> I know you found them before, so you can no, take a break. It's always good. No, <laughs> <that's all right. laughs> so, sorry, I've just remembered it. Yeah, awesome. Yeah, of course. So, Roman. And now, hammer time. I got nothing. <laughs> we know. Oh, well. <laughs> I'll turn on just because if I'm going to watch, I might as well videotape at the same time. 
I just went over and beeped his uh, hammered coin. It was like a 47, 48 signal, kind of uh, like that yeah. piece of lead. I guess that's what it is. So you want to see some things? Yeah, what do we got? Yeah. That is awesome! Uh, now that's made out of a coin. Yeah. Some trench art. That's what the boss said. That is awesome. Right now it's flying upside down. Oh, does it go like this? There you go. Oh! Well, I didn't know what kind of airplane it was. That is cool, it's man. It's fire. It's like an Airbus Beluga. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's, that's the coolest thing I've seen today. <laughs> well, I definitely just found some silver. Just not sure what it is. A little bell or is it like some sort of smashed button? It's got some fancy on it. I'll have to show this to Chris. Maybe he knows. No doubt silver though. It's beautiful whatever it is. Now my best guess is some sort of little silver bell. Ooh. Or a silver ball button maybe? I would say. Any ideas? That's the silver bell. Silver bell? I think so. That'd be my idea. Or a little charm of some sort. Mm-hmm. But if it was a bell, I'd just I expect it to um, have something in there to, to let the ring out. Whereas well, it could have been the bottom that's smashed up. Yeah, absolutely. That's lovely, guys. Yeah, it has some pretty little designs on it. I'll it, take it. I'd probably say 1700s. Yeah. 1800s, something like that. What are you over here giggling about? Smiling because I got one over here. You got one over oh, here, huh? That's great. KG2. <laughs> yeah. Chewy one. King George the Second Grizzlies is an early head. Pretend you ain't terrible. She's on there. She's peeping through. <laughs> <laughs> it's a British weedy, right? <laughs> it's a British bar. <laughs> it makes me so happy. Yeah, that's fun. Yeah. Mid 1700s. It's beeping 60. 60? Yeah. Wow. Slamming 60. Alright, well, congratulations, I guess. I have a deucer. I can put it in the whatever bin. Oh, you're not oh, just, you're no. just pocket. <laughs> yeah, I'd say that's, that's more than interesting. I've seen stuff like that before. <laughs> <laughs> that looks thin and shiny. Yeah. Oh, boy. Oh, what do you think? I think Hammered or button? Doesn't look like a button, does it? It doesn't look like a button. Uh -huh. It looks so. Are you going to pop it? Should pop it? I think you should pop it. Oh, it's a button. It's a big old tomback. <laughs> Heartbreaker. I mean, it's cool, but yeah. it's a bazinga. <laughs> In England. All right, well. Oh. 84, 85. People are big fat Romans. It's got to be a coin sounding like that. Gotta be. Definitely a big coin. It's a big wasted copper. I don't think it's gonna be a Roman. It's too, too perfectly round. Big coin though. <laughs> You're having a banner day, bud. Oh yeah. <laughs> yeah. Hammered this time. Oh. So, uh, can I touch it? Be careful, it's fro. It's we think it's. I just don't want it to blow away. I'm gonna turn my back to the wind. Yep. We think it's either um, Elizabeth the first or Charles the first. Elizabeth or Charles the first. Make it a what date range? Um, 1500s. 15s. Yeah. 1560s, 1540s. Congratulations. Thank you. Go, How deep? Um, not really that deep. It was around 9, 10, 11. Okay. And then um, it wasn't in the grass. I thought, oh, this is interesting. Because I've had a couple of that. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. on the surface yeah. in the grass. Yeah. yeah, underneath of this is like grass. We're cutting reverse plugs. And it's yeah. weird. Yeah. <laughs> and then it was in the little grass. I like, or it was in the little dirt. I was like, oh, this could be interesting. And then I saw it. I was like, I know what that is. <laughs> Congrats, man. Thank, Thank you. Nice I just popped a big old coin. I mean, it was down there. It's green. No idea what it could be. Saw it flip over down in there, so. Yeah, there it is. What is that thing? 
it's freaking huge huge and heavy actually wiping kind of good it's really heavy I don't think it's a cartwheel penny or anything like that look at this honker <laughs> is that definitely feels like a coin I don't know if I'm getting any details off of it yeah but it might be it might be gun money gun money it might be i mean you can almost see like a back of a bus there yeah if it was it, is, it almost looks like king george the second to me it might be james the second james and we should make it it could possibly be gun money it looks like a gun money um, crown to me it but, actually isn't it's pretty crude here it's not yeah. perfectly round there's but, actually more details now that it's drying out but um you're not familiar though off right uh, off the bat looking at it uh, the closest i've seen to that is probably a gun money um half crown any idea age? Um, yeah, it'd be the 1600s, just before William or William of Orange, sort of like late 1600s. That sort it's, of time. Okay, so this is quite possibly my oldest coin ever. So that makes me happy. But I'm gonna drop, hand drop it on Brad. Feel how heavy this thing is, V. <laughs> Donk! <laughs> it's wow. big and fat. That is awesome. I like it. Roman. It's Roman. <laughs> I was hoping it was gonna be. It was so deep. <laughs> Oh my gosh. It's got stuff on there. Hopefully we get some details to have an ID. There's the back of the head. Yeah, it's definitely a bustle in there. It looks like King George II, like the newer head, but he's... I don't know. I'm not a doctor. It's beautiful. Thanks. <laughs> Our host Chris has got a little cartwheel penny. Cartwheel set? I'm not sure whether it is. Yeah. It looks a bit... the edge is wrong. The edge is wrong? The edge is wrong. Yeah, so I thought it, it was right. A fatter edge. Yeah, it looks like a... That's a big old fat coin, that's for sure. No, that's not a cartwheel. That's a token. It's not a cartwheel. It is a token. You got a castle or something on there. The size of it. It's massive. Can you give me a number? Of course. Start on top. 87, 86. But that sounds good. You you My cartwheel in the States <laughs> was beeping like a 91. Well, I'll have to get a picture of that later and I'll throw yeah, I'll it up get it here. for you. <laughs> cool. Hasn't been too much after lunch. Just been wandering these pastures. There's uh, hills in the background. That's Wales. We're right on the border of Wales and England. Really pretty. Really pretty up here. It's rained. It's got windy. It's got cold. It's got sunny. <laughs> Weather here is pretty cool. But I think we're about to get out of here. So let's go home and put all this stuff on the table and see what it looks like. Well. <laughs> well. <laughs> well. Here's the little cottages we're staying in. Pretty cool back here. Out of the wind, which is nice. Brad and I are going to go over our finds from the day. Oh, you put your camp lead on the table, huh? I put whatever I put in my pouch on the lead. On the lead. <laughs> on the table. Uh, yeah, so here's here's Brad and I, my take today. I have some things that look more modern yet to be identified. Some lead. A little more modern coinage. Um... No day is not complete without the D. Here's all my little buttons. These little, these little tombacks really get you going. My favorite finds of the day. This little silver bell. You can hear it rattling a little bit. Mm -hmm. Unidentified copper. Probably a washer, not a copper. The gun money coin. Gun money. I like that a lot. Brad picked up some pottery, a, a stem. His more modern coins. Not sure on that. Is that lead? That big thing? Yeah, definitely. That's lead. And his little buttons. You got a watch wind the key. Looks like a little knee buckle. Three, three scares. I mean, <laughs> yeah, those things up there are nice and shiny. King George to the second degree. We don't know on this piece. The little plane is just awesome. Trench art. Too freaking cool. What's the matter with, buddy? That washery thing? Details come out of this. Washery. It's got denticles. Well, we're going to be here for 10 days doing this. I don't know if every single day is going to turn into an episode. I would love that and make 10 episodes over here. But next week, we'll definitely be in England again. Until then, help clean up the ground, dig it all, and take your trash with you. Why? Why because Kurt? all holes matter. <laughs>
First, you have to calibrate the compass sometimes. Marco! Oh, no! <laughs> <laughs> Is it still in U.S. time? Uh, no. Did you check the samouflage? Nope. <laughs> Good to go. Just chuck it. Just toss it. Yeah, do, do, do the hand toss thing. <laughs> All right, cover your eyes. Are you filming me, filming your drone? Dude, it's way too far. Bye, Felicia. It's way too far. Well, he did that. Yeah, he did his movement. Yeah, it's way too far. Yeah, it's way too far. Look at this. Yeah, I'm probably. That's fancy. Holy cow. That's beautiful. Oh, we should be recording that. That's beautiful. Besides your face and the reflection. It's awful. England. Day two. Is this uh, is this the first find for day two? Yeah. Ah, glad to do the honors then. You know one of these big pennies? This big ugly uh, weed here. Look <laughs> at it. It's all twisted. <laughs> so you got a little boat up. <laughs> yeah. Oh man. Look nice at that. The weather's nice today. Natural foo. Oh look at that. It's a Connecticut copper. <laughs> Be in New Jersey, my first. Well, congratulations. Thanks. I got a huge blowhole button, too. It's I heard you got a blowhole. It's a neato. Good. My hole's been blown today as well. Neato Dorito. Ew. Congrats on your uh, copper. Thanks. I'm working with uh, 8687. I was 85 on the uh, big coil. Mm. It's got to be a coin sounding like that. Be a big fat Roman. It might be slightly larger than a coin. Well, it's not very deep either. Cartwheel? Huh? Cartwheel. No, people a little higher than that, but. Come on, be there. In the hole? Yeah. Hmm. <sighs> Try not to get too much snow on the screen because then I'll lose being able to focus proper. Over that way a little bit, huh? Yeah, it wasn't very deep. Get out of there. That's it. That was deep and high. Smaller than expected. Yeah. I think it's potatoes. There's no way. It's got to be like a farthing or something. We found farthings in the U.S. that beat really high like that. Is there another one? Give me that meat pullet. Yeah, get after it. That was supposed to be shiny. It's a coin, man. You think so? Yeah, I think it's going to be a little farthing of some sort. It's just toasted like your first. Early but hey, but hey, is it a but hey? But hey, more than I have. Good morning, party boy. Hey, welcome. welcome. You, didn't, you didn't miss anything. Yeah, I know. I have a time back button. Brad has three coppers. He has three now. He found one at half an inch after the last. My spidey senses were tingling when I went to bed last night and it was snowing. I decided, you know what, let's just sleep in. <laughs> we stayed up too late. Yes, yes. But it was fun. Did. But it like I said, fun. you didn't miss anything, so game on. Welcome. Thanks, man. <laughs> Stop snowing. Just rain now. Had a deep beep here. I think it was around 80. It looks interesting. Odd shape, anyway. Be a buckle. It is a buckle. Nice. Look at that thing. Probably 1650s if I had to guess. Some cool buckle. One I've never found before. So that makes me happy. Different kind of relic. You wanna see it? Look at my look at my buckle. Isn't that cool? Thank you so much. I love it. <laughs> that is cool, man. I like it. I like this kind of stuff. I take that over a copper. That's beautiful, man. <laughs> What date range do you think of that? I'm calling 1650. Maybe 1652. That's fair. That's fair. Yeah. Beautiful. Thank you. People are walking this way, so I'm going to walk this way too. <laughs> I think it's a bale seal. 
Yeah. 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 Those are cool. Anything on it? Yeah. There's writing on it. Can I touch it? You bet. That is wild. Look at that thing. Can I see your uh, your thingy, TJ? He's got some odd shaped, Ooh. almost round thing. What is that? Oh, that's 20 pounds. Is that He's got a bag seal. Yeah, yeah. That's a bag seal. Oh, nice. Those are fun. That's, that's cool yeah, looking. Yeah. Got any uh, design on it? Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah it's oh, yeah. Where are we going? Hammered Hill. Zero hour is upon us. We're going to Hammered Hill. Yes. That's why I brought this to England with me. I am, I, <sighs> am big coil. I am absolutely thrilled that you brought it because this has never seen a PI machine before, ever. And from what I've seen, that machine should kill it on this hill. Should kill it. If they're there, if they're and there, I swing know. over it, You'll know it. It's coming out of the ground. I'm a little jealous. <sighs> Hammer time. A little jealous I don't have one. <laughs> okay, to fully understand Hammered Hill, I strongly recommend you go watch Brandon's episode from last year, Metal Detecting a Horde of Medieval Silver Coins. Hammered Hill is where they found the Shrumpshire Short Cross Horde. So any of the Short Cross Hammered Silver Coins we find, get documented as part of the Horde. Now this field has been turned over since last year, and obviously it's been hammered by other detectorists on other tours. But this is one of the reasons why we came to England. His first hole. First hole. Let me, to be let's fair, go. all holes matter. Yeah, this is true. Any holes are good. Okay guys, first signal on Hammer Hill. I see it. It was a little squirrely. And it, I haven't touched it yet. There it is, it's a cut. Cut hammered. Ooh. Oh wow! Eh? Oh wow! It's beautiful too. It looks like it, huh? Get it! <laughs> get it! Here, I'll, get, I got it. I'll get it. <laughs> get out of here! Get out of here! It's my job. <laughs> oh, it's beautiful. Oh, cut. look at the, the it's condition on that, cut, man. Yeah. You can see it. Oh, it's beautiful. Can I whip and Oh, yeah! yeah. Taco! <laughs> Taco Tuesday! It's Wednesday. <laughs> It'll work. Nice! Oh my gosh. There you go. Dude. Full oh, gosh. Is this? Congratulations. Can I, can I foo you? This is number 40. Can I foo? Foo it. Foo. <laughs> I want to foo it. Flip and foo? Just be really careful you don't chance for it, man. That's probably why it was dirty. Because it was cup folded over, Brandon. Yeah. Yeah. Oh gosh, I can see him on there. Oh, it's a. If this wasn't folded, this would have been like my best condition one, probably. <laughs> congratulations. Congratulations. Let's, let's see no, close to that. <laughs> Don't congratulate him. <laughs> I walked literally right there. Yeah? Well, you had to walk here, so. Yeah, I had to walk here. And that's why we're here. It says John the Short Cross. It's very difficult to say. Um, on the. On the portrait of his, of his face, I guess you've got there. Yeah, the, the cross would be on the other side. Yeah, the yeah. inside, I should uh, say. But it'll be to do with these, the way that the curls and the hair, around mm -hmm. his hair, and the, the amount of pellets on his head, and the distance between the cross and the scepter, will tell whether it's like um, Henry or John. Or so we're talking 1100, 1300, 1280 to 1249. Oh, yes, yeah, that's, that's nice. Born. Oh, that's I'm down there. I knew you were going to do it. I'm down there. <laughs> oh me. my god. Hit me. Show me. It's in the hole. It's I know. Holy. Oh, you got to be oh, kidding me. That's a big one. Is that a Lizzie? I don't It's got to be a Lizzie. It's, it's huge. huge. <laughs> that's oh, bro. It's a Lizzie. It's oh, a Lizzie. Right? Yeah, it's a Lizzie. I hope it's older than Bobby's. I hope it's untouched. <laughs> that, I don't know what that is. That's something else. That's different, Nick. Is that a Lizzie? I don't think it's a Lizzie. Wow! Holy cow! Here, get some food, buddy. Yeah, yeah. I'm yeah. not gonna rob it. Don't worry. Oh, oh my oh! gosh! What is what going on there? there? What just happened? Look at that! This is a 15. <laughs> yeah, this this, this gotta have a date above the shield, probably. Oh, it's beautiful. It's huge, oh, man. Oh my gosh! I touched oh. it. <laughs> <laughs> what is that? That's a gentleman facing right. It's on the yeah, back of the 7th. It says taco right there. Oh, that's so. 10th. That's 10th. Well, 
Oh my god. Yeah, Holy oh, cow! That's Carl's that's the twelfth. Uh, Holy that's, cow! That's one one. I heard you got one one, TJ. Yeah. Wow! Congrats. Oh my god. Can I, can I touch beautiful. it? Go ahead. It's heavy. That's oh. beautiful. <laughs> I knew that sounded different. Use two hands. Thank you. Hey, congratulations. Thank man. you very much. Wow. Thanks. Bro. Um. What? I'm going to cry. <laughs> <laughs> Why am I shaking for your coin? I was say, man, you're either cold or you're super happy. Holy cow, man. It's freaking beautiful. We'll get some nice close ups of this. I had to bang, huh? Did it bang? It was deep. Bang? A deep target. Nice, like, oh, that nice sounds fun. And it wasn't yeah. as sharp as all the coke that I've been trying to work around. Just a nice, <sighs> nice deep high tone. Here you go, buddy. Oh, well, thanks. Maybe, maybe you'll Our see that again in a couple of years after we turn it into the authorities. Is there a title? <laughs> there might oh. be one above the shield. John goes up to 12. Uh, goes up to 12 uh, I'm going to dig. Yeah, later, Dude. Dude. Yeah, that's, that's do you know what this is? Yes, I do. J A C O B. So that's James. And that's James the first of England and James the sixth of Scotland. And that's X one one. Yeah, for twelve. Yeah, which makes it a shilling. A shilling. A James the first shilling. Okay, there you go. Reverse. And then you're looking around about. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Crap, isn't it? Um, yeah, you're looking there or thereabouts. Early 1600s, around 1603 to 1624. So you're not old and Bob yet. <laughs> <laughs> I assume that's what they should sound like. A nice high tone. Oh. Iron, awesome. <laughs> mm, foil, that's fun. Iron. Oh, maybe that. Maybe so. Alright, okay. Ugh. Little piece of lead. Freaking foil, 15 inches deep. Ugh. No! No! It doesn't feel like a coin. That's not a coin. Oh, God. Oh, a staple. Awesome. This is what I needed. Another staple. Johnny definitely got one. John definitely got one. John and I were the only two who haven't hadn't gotten one yet, or whatever I just said. I he just got one. And this better than not be a zinger. I'm gonna cry in the bushes by myself. There's definitely something around right there, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And this is uh, Hammered Hill. Mm -hmm. Come out of there. It. It is. Oh, oh yes! Oh, yes. <laughs> That's wow. Taco Wednesday for me too. <laughs> oh, it's all there, baby. Oh yes. Yeah. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> Oldest coin I've ever dug. Dude. Can't really say I found it because we already knew they were here. Oh. It, it's, it's about to go, that's for sure. Super careful. Some of these have been Irish and Scottish, which makes them super rare. So, really? So just be... So, wait, 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 wait. so it, was that, it was that close for blood pudding, dude. And yeah. I've just... We never really made that yes. bet, buddy. I remember. <laughs> there was a blood pudding bet that I've made. And it was... It was uh... That took me about 30 or 40 holes of digging iron. Uh, he wasn't. And mine looks like... It, it, it's made of iron almost. They're saying it's a giant the short cross, 1100s, early 1200s. Not too much details on it, and I'm scared to touch it because it's ready to go. Put it away gently and on to the next. Why not? Put it away. Here's John's. His actually looks like a silver coin. <laughs> Ooh. Pop out. Oh no! You you that's that's some fresh markage on there, sir. <laughs> I guess it, it. I guess it happens to all of us. You've uh, you've definitely made it yours. Congratulations. It's mine. It is yours. Well, maybe in another year or so after the government takes a peek at it. I'm swallowing. But we did it, buddy. We did it. Oh. 
Let's, Let's do it some more. Let's do it again. Where are you going with that? I want to see it. I was going to show you. Let me do it real quick because. I'm like gonna. He just got a long cross. Thirteen hundreds. Did a little flippy. Oh, look at that thing. That is beautiful. As I'm touching your hand ever so softly. <laughs> Congrats. It's actually been a long, long time since we turned on the camera. I found mine, and this place just turned off. It's probably been two, almost three hours, and that's the first notable find since mine. Well, the first hammy, anyway. All right, maybe you turned it back on. What'd you do? Brandon! Where is it? Was it even in the dirt? The boy did long cross. Could yeah, get some clue there, buddy. The, other side. <laughs> the boy did long cross. It's beautiful. You just keep go, 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 go. Go, 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 go. <laughs> go, go, go. If you're looking for a triangle, you just on the back. Look at that. Holy cow. Is it in the grass? <laughs> it was like two inches. That's insane. Which one's long shanks? Henry oh, the second. Okay. It's called a double cross. Oh um, yeah, it's cross. a vo voided long cross. Voided long cross. I like double cross better. <laughs> Good night. I won't, oh, geez, Brad, thanks. <laughs> Mid 13th century, 1200s. Hammered. Hammer time. Hammer time. I have a little bump for that. Boop. Thanks, buddy. Well, that was Hammered Hill. My first experience at it. I'm glad I brought the pulse machine because I would have been upset if I didn't. But it just so happens that nothing was deep today. So we come back here again. I'll have the AT Max instead of the uh, pulse. I'll bring this still, but it wasn't necessary today. They were finding hemis in the grass because they do flip these fields. But we're out of here. It's time to go. We'll go home and take a peek at Brad's coin again. Quick little wrap up. Very quick. I mean, I got a little, couple little pieces of lead and stuff, but shoe buckle frame. Not sure on the thing to the left. Definitely served purpose at one time. Tom back button. No day is not complete without the D. And my uh, rusty coin from the 1100s. <laughs> You got one cent? <laughs> I see. I see. You do have a couple coppers. Really cool blowhole. You might have flipped that over. Yeah, it's actually the, uh, it's, it's fancy. Blowhole, uh, with a nipple. All right, there you go. A nipple blowhole. Mm -hmm. Another piece of silver spoon. Oh, and a uh, big 1600 oh, silver. Like Walk them around. Yeah, there we go. There he is. That is. That was that was a fun day. Huh? Really fun. You know what? I think an apology is in order from you because today marks the. Oh yeah, mm. uh, today's Wednesday and I couldn't get a video out because we're in England. <laughs> Sorry. Yeah, yeah. It's just, I mean, that, that's... Do you even remember that? It's like maybe a couple months from then. It's a milestone. It's a moment. I don't know. Here's all the silvers today on this log over here. Here's all the hammered silver today all together. Eight all together. It was a special day. Couple from the horde, a couple later, and a big fat one right in the middle. Good job, B Red. It's just a baby. And until next week, help clean up the ground, dig it all, and take your trash with you. Why? Because all holes matter. Hands. All hammies matter. <laughs>
Eat your blood better. Precisely. It's not a little bite either. Hmm? Yeah, you really went for it. It's yeah. not a little bite either. Is it supposed to be bad? It's supposed yeah. to be delicious. It's a delicacy. It's not bad. Oh, well, that's supposed to be a punishment. <laughs> Where did you have it? This is no, amazing. blood sausage is what I had. Mm. This is good. I mean, it's really bad. This is a punishment. It's really good. Order blood pudding if you ever come to England. <laughs> I was here, here. I'm flip it around and I'll take a bite. You'll get the reaction yeah. you're looking for. <laughs> <laughs> it's, 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 it's good. It's good. It's good. <laughs> How do they say they don't like it then? Yeah. I don't know. Oh, we don't like that. Yeah, it has a it's, 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 it's fairly amazing. <laughs> it's, it's very good. Do, do I, I do like it. It's very good. No, I wouldn't say it's very good. No, it's not bad. They put some on here. It's got mashed potatoes with it. Butter. <laughs> no. Nate? No. No? No. Just, just a little bit? No, I just had some. <laughs> oh, you just had some. You don't like it? No. Did you try it? Yeah. It's not bad. I thought I'd gag. That was a disappointing reaction from everyone. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> I've put worse things in my mouth. <laughs> you tried it? Yeah. When we had it in it's, like it's like order. It was England, day three. It was a nasty, disgusting, brain filled day. But we found some stuff. Let's check it out. <laughs> a lot of junk so far today, but I want to pop this semi live. Just in case. Deeper. Getting down to that Roman layer. Oh, what's that? What is that? Buckle? Oh, that is awesome. Let me get it in frame. I think it's a complete knee buckle with tongue and shape. It is. Oh, that is freaking beautiful. I knew that was going to be a good target. Look at that. Check that thing out. That's probably the hallmark right there. Complete knee buckle. Tongue and shape. It's got a little design on it. That is freaking awesome. I love this kind of stuff. I mean, I like coins as well. Who doesn't like coins? But I like the personal items. Especially when they're that beautiful. It's a good way to start the day. Good enough for a hand drop. You want to start the day like yesterday? You want to see my buckle? <laughs> you got a buckle? Yeah. Yeah. I love it. I love I absolutely love pushed. it. Wow, dude. It's complete. A complete knee buckle. Yeah, that's special. <laughs> it's got like a maker's on the uh, bottom of the uh, shape. Yeah, you want to flip it over? That's like uh, late 1800s. <laughs> I like that stuff. Yeah. You see the little maker's? <laughs> that's a nice early buckle. It's a good way to start the day. Yeah, that's neat. Now let's find some hammers. How about some rain? Turn it on. <laughs> some rain. <laughs> well, it's definitely trying to rain now. So everybody says? I don't know. It's oh, awful. It's awful suspicious. Uh, yeah, that is stuff. That, doesn't that, that break. looks stuff very doesn't usually break that perfect, does it? Very, uh, on In, purpose. Intentional, yeah. Here, let's give it a little shot. Got the right color to it. I don't see any letters on it. I don't either. Probably, Hell of a hit, though, man. Not. Hell of a hit. Brandon and TJ went home after lunch because it was raining harder than they wanted it to. And it was raining after lunch, but it just stopped. And I found something pretty cool. It's definitely different. It's definitely gold gilted. No idea what it is, but it has some sort of, my guess is glass stone in there. I had a problem IDing this in the field because the one I found was broken. Here's one I found in the US. 
It's a wax seal matrix. This one's actually complete. It has a watch winding key attached to it as well. One I found in England didn't have a pictogram. This one has a pictogram that translates to, I hope you are well. Wax seal matrix. Probably Georgian era, 1700s. Too bad she's broken. Really cool relic though. So when we get on video, because I think it's pretty awesome. Uh, he said it stopped raining. Yeah. <laughs> oh, it is a counter stamp. Can she's, I touch it? Yeah, she's stamped. You can put a, a finger on it. A light finger? Yeah, see if you can get a name off of it. This is, uh... Careful. It, that's not going to go anywhere. You sure? Yeah. Okay. Is it upside down? I think it's upside down. Oh, it's... Yeah, there you go. Ten... Robins, maybe? I can't tell. We'll look at it later. That's cool. Your first kind of stamp, copper. Number one. Anything? Yeah, Orange hands? How many carrots should we eat today? <laughs> Too many. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> look at how it fell. I don't know. Good luck with that. <laughs> look at this view. Brad's got an 88, 89 cartwheel penny numbers. Yeah, it's that deep. Be my first. Nathan my got first. one today. I can't dig mine in the states like dirt. <laughs> trying to stay away from it. You scared of it? Yeah, definitely. I'd be scared of it. In case it's like a two shillings or something. Probably gonna probe it from the top side. Oh, Cop. Cop. Little copper. Oh. Deep and high, like. Yeah, it's beating real high. Oh man, is there another one in there? Is that the problem? <laughs> Why was that thing up there? Jeez, man. <laughs> Not even a good looking one. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm sorry, I haven't found the coin today. <laughs> yeah. Look at this beautiful view though. Mm. You can see snow on the top of the mountain. Yeah, yeah. the whale's got snow. Alright, on to the next. We're going to be getting out of here soon, but I just popped a crazy deep coin. Pop the plug, move that much earth, square down at the bottom of that hole. Out came this. And I'm thinking King George II. Yep, KG2. Mid-1700s. Nothing crazy for over here, but the depth was pretty crazy. I'm just wiping mud back onto it. It's been a nasty day. Today we're starting in the horse pasture, horse paddock, where we ended yesterday. And uh, so far I have a flat button, and TJ has a silver. Was this your first hole? It was my second hole. Second hole? Yeah. There we go. 1865. Victoria. Can I take a peek in the hand? Yeah. Looks like a mark. I know, doesn't it? 1865. That's beautiful. Actually, you know what's funny? I found one of these in America. Did you really? Yeah. <laughs> at one of our parks. That's cool, man. Yeah. Silver is always good. It's like half dime size. Yeah. Look up it up. is always good. Look nice hit. Is it deep at all? Uh, five inches. Nice. Yeah. Well. Go find a bigger one now. <laughs> <laughs> I just found a copper that I wasn't, <laughs> had no idea what it was, and it's one of these right here. You say this is a, a mine token? Mm -hmm. From the north of Wales, so it's from Anglesey, and it's from the um, copper or lead mine. That's definitely it. And it's that scripty letter, you know, seen on the back that was throwing me off. That's different and cool. I like it. Nice. I like different stuff. <laughs> Little excitement going over here. Our host, Chris. Looks like he's got some hammered silver. <laughs> what is it? Just keep going. Might hit the other side, get some details. Yeah, some coming through there. Ooh. You recognize it yet? It looks like a little Edward, Edward the first or third. Edward the first or third? Think. Looks like it has nice relief. Ooh, oh look. 
Hello. Dirt. See his little face? Yeah. Oh, that's a nice condition besides like a little chip of it. Would you look at that? This field has been so quiet for me. I'm digging this foil. And our host goes right in the middle of the field and pops an Edward the first. I'll skip that 1300s. Yeah. <laughs> Long cross. It's got beautiful relief. Three, Look six, at this guy. Nine, Twelve cannonballs. Look at that guy. Mm. Look at those locks. Yeah. He was a, he's a fancy one. <laughs> That's what we're after. Hopefully we get some. I'm shiny. Shut up. It, it's, it's not hammered shiny, but it's, it's definitely shiny. I'm looking for Vicky shiny. <sighs> it's bigger than like the little three pence, so I don't know. Really? It's fun. You having fun now, huh? Oh. Yes. Oh, what is that? It's a it's a pine tree shilling. <laughs> that's gonna be old, I think. I hope it's old. Oh, well, it's good. silver. I'm happy. I almost got the fool in the camera. No, it's not that old. No. There's George. Oh, Georgie oh. boy. <laughs> I can give it a little swipey poo now. Yeah, now you can play with it. Yeah. So we have a George the Fifth. Pretty cool looking coin. I mean, it's got a lion and a crown on it. And it's a uh, 1925. 19 on the left part of the crown, 25 on the right. Hey, Georgie boy. Day four is coming to a close. Worked hard for that one. And uh, we'll be getting out of here shortly. Hopefully there's more on the way out, but you never know. What's some sound? Sound. Low 80s. Oh, it sounds like a coin. Watch your wrist. There's a lot of uh, noises in this area. So, I think I'm going to sink back up my machine in a second. Big fat Roman. Oh, it's in the hole? Yeah. I think it is in the hole. No, I think it's around the cusp of the hole. We're going to find out here. Oh no, these are synced up to my headphones now. Should have been right there. Why live digs? Oh. There it is. That's silver. Oh. I hope so. Looks like it. Is that a Canadian quarter? <laughs> that was deeper than I expected. Some very low res silver. If it is silver, low res. <laughs> <laughs> Rub on that a little bit. Well, it is silver, but it's just completely beat. Uh, they're telling me it's a bullhead. 1817, George the Third. <laughs> 1817 silver, one shilling. They tell me it's a good looking coin, but it's this one's pretty wasted. All right, well, that's cool. Two silvers back to back. Ten robins. <laughs> All right, well, here's the wrap from days three and days day three and day four. Not days. Here's a take. So, this is day three and day four. Start with the B rad. Three, three, four, four. Yeah, oh, th yeah, these are. Oh, I don't need here. Nope. We'll go with you. Knee buckle, some lead. Mm -hmm. World War One hat pin. Nice. Yeah. Thimble, buttons. buttons. More modern to older. My only high. Well, two highlights. So we have an Isle of Man, 1758, half penny. Yeah. The. Okay. There's the. Uh, it's got like three boots on it. It looks like a. Anyway. And. Uh, Ten robins counter. Your first counter stamp. Yeah. And this is my day three. Yep. Wasn't expecting to dig an Enfield bullet over here. Dropped Enfield. <laughs> but I guess it is an English gun. Some Tom back buttons, a dandy. A couple thimbles. That is Vicky. Vicky. And a King George II. Really nice shoe buckle. Knee buckle frame. The uh, trade coin weight. And that ended up being a wax matrix. Really pretty. It's just broken. Every time you do that, it gets knuckle. 
And this is day four. Mm -hmm. That's right. right. We got a bunch of lead day four. Those sounded amazing. Yeah, they were deep too. Oh, I had you a button day. A ton of buttons. Yeah. Ton of buttons. Mm -hmm. And looks like a copper that's been mashed up. Probably. Or a hammered copper. <laughs> yeah, that's my hammer. Maybe silver. I hope Buckley so. thing. In Victoria. A couple big pennies. There's my more modern stuff, my pile of lead. But the this thing's interesting. One of the guys said it was like a lead needle or something. And uh, some buttons, spoon piece, big penny. That's the uh, mining, the whales mining copper. I got two little silvers at the end of the day. Nice. Like bang bang too. Yeah, back to back. <laughs> Is that a bullhead? Bullhead and I forget what that one was, maybe a sixpence? Or three pence? Probably. I think it's a six pence. Probably. And until next week, help clean up the ground, dig it all, and take the trash with you. Bye, Brandon. Bye, bud. What's up? Try making some mash! Because all holes matter. That too. <laughs> <laughs>
I guess I'm larger. It's little and it was making a high tone. Oh, you're high down there. You, you don't know. No visual yet. No visual. <sighs> oh, 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 what is that? Is oh, that silver? Oh, oh, that's silver. oh my God. So Did you do it again? Yep. Now. Yes, he has it. Brad. Oh, Brad. Oh. What do you got? Be now? so I'm, I'm being careful. Combat. I'm being careful. Oh, it's a button. <laughs> oh my god. Uh, look at that depth, kid. That is one <laughs> button. <laughs> Get it out of there. See if there's any fancy at least. Oh, there is. Oh, that's a nice button though, Jeez. yeah. Wow. It's beautiful. <laughs> Heck of a hit, kid. Thanks. All right, I need to dig a hole. Jeez, that a shame. Oh, wow. This about gave me a heart attack when I flipped it. You can see the impression right there. Like, oh my god. Oh, oh. It's gotta be a Tom back. But yeah, nice pretty one at least. Full shankage. Oh, that color and round over here. Coinage? Yes. Yes. Oh, that's a beautiful William. I won't show you the back. Just stay impressed with the front. Yeah? <laughs> yeah. It's just that bad, huh? Yeah, there's nothing on the back. Like, you gotta you gotta turn it there we go in the sun a little bit. Yeah, the, the obverses. That's a good looking one though. Yeah. I wish the uh field was that kind on the hammies. Or on the uh Roman. On the Roman. I'm so not used to the lingo. Yeah, I know. <laughs> I, I say wrong stuff all the time. I was like, what kind of castle fort iron front? Norman? I don't know. I don't know what I'm saying. I just look like an idiot. I get Chris to say everything and then I just parrot what he says so I look smart. That's the way to do it. Brilliant. They do come out pretty crummy though. The little Romans though. The little ones, if we can get on a if little you get Roman. get the guilty ones? Yeah, they got like the little uh, detail on them still. Hmm. But the big ones, they're just a slug. Well, I just got my first button, so. <laughs> Cheerio. Cheerio. Tips off for now. Just flipped up something that looks around here. I see a big button. Big time back. Oh, there's a design. It's almost like a snowflake. If that's a time back. That's the biggest time back I've ever dug. Nope, not a time back. Just a big, big dandy button. Silver wash dandy button. It's a pretty one though. All right, there's stuff here. Hey buddy. Hey buddy. We just had some lunch and we're back at it. I got my best signal so far today. So let's live dig it. Sounds like a really deep quiet if I've ever heard one. Oh no, of course right on a rock. There we go. Be shiny. Deepy. We got a deepy. Right there. Go fish. Oh, there's that rock. So we pop her loose. Come on. Come on. What is this? Be silver. Be silver. Be silver. I I, uh, I don't know if it's silver or not. I might need some help, fellers. I don't know. I don't know. It looks black. Uh -oh. I don't know. It looks like uh -oh. old silver to me. Oh, dude, oh, you've dude. got a hammered. You think? That's hammered. a freaking hammered love token. <laughs> oh my gosh. That dude, is silver, right? You got a hammered that's love a, token. Are you joking? You know him, Are you joking? Yeah. Yeah. What are you talking about? No, that is a hammered love token. Yeah. Are you so. <laughs> you you got we've got milled love tokens right yeah right well what? I've never in my whole life well, seen the hammered version what are you talking about so see how it's got a bend here and a bend here yeah bend down bend up so you'd give this as a token to your mate no I, I a, know what love right, tokens right? are I found them but what makes you think this is a love token there's nothing on it it's the ass it, it, yeah it's the, shape. it's the shape man the shape of it absolutely well let me finish cleaning it and we'll do a close up that's silver you Dude, think it's hammered that's a hammered, that's a love, hammered token. love token yeah i hate you right now i hate you right now 
<laughs> I love that you hate me right now. I don't even know what I have. <laughs> it doesn't look like much for details, but they're telling me, just by the way it's bent up, that it was a love token. And here comes Brad. He's going to be like, what is this piece of aluminum foil? <laughs> Apparently I found something good. I live dug it, so that's good. You live dug one finally? I don't know. It's, it's got weight. That's because it's silver. There's nothing on it. Something on it. Yeah, it's schmooze. 400 year old schmooze. They're, they're telling me the way that it's bent up, it's a love token. Love that, token. That's how they made their love tokens over love here. Token. It's, it's not whacked by... That's what I said. It looks like some plow schmacks to me. Purpose, purpose bend down, purpose up. One down, one up. Yep. He said I win the bet because it's older than seventeen ninety nine. For sure. Even though I don't know what it was. It's a love token on a coin. Mm. <laughs> well, let's go uh, show Chris to confirm. Um, well, mm. this is curious about this. Oh, you know what that is, didn't you? Uh, I don't know what that is. I found that earlier. I forgot to show it to you. Yeah, it's the lead button. It is a lead button. That's what I thought it was because yeah. you turn it over. It's it looks like this will go here. That could be quite early, though. How early we think in medieval? Yeah. It almost looks like there's a cross there as well. But they were telling me what this is, but what well, your confirmation? Oh. Silver love token. Yes. That's what they said. Um, William the third. Um it'll be it's you see like that it's bent up. Well, one bend up, one bend down. One down, one yeah. up. And it's shaped like an S. Mm hmm So it'd be a, a sixpence, sixteen ninety six, and uh, William the third. Uh, 1696. Yeah, uh, generally that you get them as George the first and George the second, but generally 1696. And the idea was that they do crimp it, flat, flatten it down, get all of the design off it, mm -hmm. pull one side down, one side up, and then if they saw the lady that they liked, they'd hand it to the lady, and it would be almost says, uh, saying, "Will you date me?" Mm. And then the woman would go. <laughs> 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 and then brilliant we'll them. <laughs> brilliant but yeah so it's a william the third sixpence love token thank you very much it means i won the bet for the five pounds each from the boys tonight yeah the first silver older than 1800 so mm. yeah i like that button a lot yeah it's beautiful so chris just looked up the button uh, and there we have it there i'm just missing the shank on the back oh, little bit different of a design but same time period and it is medieval 1300s to 1500s and that's on the portable antiquities website but it's to me really that's treasure shape. yeah yeah that's treasure to me I'd be very happy with that <laughs> you want to see a really rotten mazinga i just dug <laughs> in the land of hammered silver and this little shiny thing comes out of the ground oh, no. <laughs> deep in right around 50 like all the other hammies we, we've got these ones and um, usually yeah on, on the inside it's like it, says, it says you can see off like for offer king offer and it's not and you look at it it says tear offer <laughs> tear <laughs> off. uh, yeah. that's rubbish I'm going to put it in the rubbish pocket now yeah, tear offers <laughs> but that's awesome it is absolutely beautiful out here. Oh, it's B Red. We should do a B Red check in. My silver is confirmed love token. It's a William the Third, sixpence, sixteen nineties. Eighteen oh two. Sixteen nineties, bro. Good job. Oh, the lead button. It's medieval. Really? Thirteen hundreds to fifteen hundreds. I think I have a lead button. Oh, I said we should do a B Red check in. You've been quiet over That's here. It's a lead button. That's not lead on this side. That's a definitely side leady. Of the lead button. <laughs> yeah, a lot of Look buttons. At this. That's a large disc thing. Yeah, I know, but it's like super ancient anyway. Oh, you got a knee buckle in here. I never saw that. Get that. Shine some light on that. That was was it cracked before? Early target. You dug it. Yeah. <laughs> you get a lot of stuff. I'm yeah. going for quality, not quantity. So there is a little uh. A pin of some sort or like earwax cleaner or something too thick earwax cleaner combo possible purse holder maybe medieval hmm well that wasn't too far from the lead button earlier mm. a bunch of one of those oh yeah that's the that's the big fat Roman that was in that other field where we got tore up yeah 
And there's some old. Look, uh, yeah, a couple older coppers in here. They're wasted. I know, two old. Why don't Brandon. they come out like Brandon's? Brandon's is gorgeous. Yeah, I know. He Damn. got that with him. He brought it with him. <laughs> I wouldn't mind a one that looked that dang nice. Very good. Well, I might get some B-roll of this uh, castle from 1066 in a little while, but I'll dig a couple more plugs. That corner's calling my name. You look comfortable. Johnny. Got me a little bit of green in the hole. One of those coppers, huh? I think so. Yeah. Looks like it, doesn't it? Why? Why did Brandon's is the only one that came out nice looking? Uh -huh. <laughs> I smell just, collusion. This was just a couple holes ago. Nice. I love the old keys. Absolutely. I wonder what that one was for. That almost looks like a gas key to me. Yeah. Like the old it's, like it's lamps. Fancy. I don't know. I somebody somebody will correct me. Oh, chopped your copper. I was hoping. Cheerio. Uh, I was hoping for chastity belt. Yeah. <laughs> it's always handy to have one of those keys on hand. Absolutely. At all times. Well, I like it. Yeah. It's not all bent up and it's all there. That's always good. Thank you. They're, they're the having sun. a picnic over there or something. You're enjoying the sun. Isn't this beautiful? Beautiful. <sighs> Outstanding. Nice light breeze. Mm -hmm. Not windy and hail like no. two days ago. <laughs> not I just left Johnny and he gave us a symbol for hammer and he seems really excited. I gotta drop the stuff. Yeah, no doubter. <sighs> What's going on here? Oh, oh yeah! Hammered silver. Oh. oh let me let me change camera so I can get some detail of that. Oh my god. Dude, what's <laughs> what you got? So the, the copper came out right there that we just showed you. Oh. I don't know oh no, I'm gonna get in the sun. Do you mind? That's the copper. That's the copper. Yeah. So what is that? That's a Lizzie. Yeah. Yeah. Oh my god. You can see the That's date coming through. Ah. It's a, it's a 1573. <sighs> That's a Lizzie. It's a Lizzie. A I wanted a Lizzie. Yeah. Yours, was, uh, yours was the sixpence. Yeah. So that's the three pence. He's touching yeah. your coin. And yours yeah, he's, he's flipping it all around. Oh. Well, then I'm going to touch it now. Is it? What's oh. on it? It's, it's a, a Lizzie. On Should have a rose on one side? Yeah, I saw the Maybe. rose. Yeah. 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 Yep, I saw the rose. And here we that's are trying to do diplomatic affairs. That word. You're going to whip out the foo, fine sir. Oh my Cool. Here, here, here. Here. Are you gonna whip out the food for him? Brad's got it. Sure of him. Wait, wait. Dice rub. Oh no, we would never. You hit it. It's beautiful, man. You can see. Holy cow! You see, it says Elizabeth around the other side, around this top edge. <laughs> Oh, it is beautiful. Tomorrow or something too, or maybe right now. Sorry, I brought my. It is a 1573. Here, you play with your coin. <laughs> That's what we're here for. Yeah, buddy. <sighs> Still not as old as Bob's. <laughs> That's all right. You're the man. You worked hard for that. Yep. Congrats, yep. brother. Hey, thank you. Mm. Thank you. <laughs> I, guess I, I guess I lost it again. That's incredible, man. Not even all that horribly deep. Yeah. Nice tone. We just gotta get over it. That guy. They are here. Queen Elizabeth I hammered silver is one of my favorite English coins. For one, they're absolutely beautiful coins. And these eyeballs have witnessed two of these 16th century hammered silvers dug all the way back here in the United States of America. Bob dug one dated 1561, all the way back in episode 70 of the Hoover Boys. And our friend Steve dug one dated 1569 last year in episode 208, and that wasn't even his best find that day. This is one of those coins that I really wanted to dig on this trip to England. Congratulations to John for beating me to it, and on with the show. You mean to look at it? Yeah, come look at this. I'm gonna move your shovel. It's all it's bent over and and it's got the look. It's got the look. It's got the look of black. It does have the look. Yeah, it's got the look of ham. Get some foo on that. <laughs> Stat. Yeah, yeah, that was... <laughs> 
beautiful web. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Looks aluminum. Why is why is this shiny and there's not? Is that a coin? I don't know. It's pretty rotten. Any details? No. You have good eyes. We do believe it used to be. I think it's got some sort of fire damage or something. Well, we know what it is. Unfortunately, it doesn't have much for details, but it's it's heavy, and it's the right size. It's heavy. I wish I could be more happy for you. <laughs> hey oh <laughs> I don't know yet. It's just a it's just a ball with a shiny round edge. Really thin. And really thin. Belly. It beeped around 70 like his Lizzie. It's it's yet to be undetermined, but it's looking good. Can somebody notify Brad? Brad. Brad. He's way up by the hedges. Oh, Who's Brad? Who's Brad? Brad. <laughs> Brad. What are you uh, Brad? We, we can we can we can let him dig. It's probably a big old bazinga. Let's see. Mm. Break it. Break Make it. it happen. Oh, happen. Make it happen. Yeah! Oh, yeah! Yes! Oh, yes! Oh, yes! <laughs> we gotta leave in like yeah. five minutes. No! Oh my! Mm. Mm. Right here. Mm. Dude. Did you get him up? All right. Oh, feels good. That. Oh, that feels good. It's giant. That's how you end the day. Oh. Wait. I want to keep. Can I keep the mud? <laughs> you gotta keep the mud. I want to keep the mud. It looks like a lizard again. Oh. Ah. <laughs> oh, it feels so good. I bet. It's, it's, I bet it does. I'm not coming to look. <laughs> I'm coming to bottom feed. <laughs> just, day, just man. get your head down in here, real deep, like. Big, hammer. <laughs> <laughs> you can see it from there, can't you? <laughs> you, you like it. Get out of the hole. Get out of the hole. <laughs> 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 ah, ah, wait, wait. Thank you. Wow. Actually, can you take the camera? Unbelievable. Can you yeah. take this? Okay. <sighs> Unbelievable. I'm gonna pop it nice and slow here. Oh yeah, I'm like it's hot. Uh, uh -oh. I had I had your job. It look at that it's coin impression. Uh, your thumbs look worse than mine. Oh. <laughs> you gonna whip me, buddy? Spray him. Yeah. yeah. Let's get some of that. <laughs> yeah. You want, you want me to spray you? Yeah. You got fast, 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 fast. <laughs> oh. Goodness oh man! Uh, Somebody hand me some soap. I'm gonna use that. Uh, we'll finish cleaning up and do a close up. Oh, we will. Yes! <laughs> Holy cow! Was it down there? Not terrible. It was. It was. It was, yeah. straight, it, it was at the bottom. The imprint. Right? Yeah. Yeah. Beautiful. <laughs> take that. Use that for the photo. <laughs> Can I take that? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> That's no, okay, huh? John. Yeah. Well, it is a Lizzie. They actually wore the face off of this one. It's a 1566. The last six looks like a five, but I looped it. It's a 66. So it's still not older than Bobby's from the U.S. It's five years newer, but whew, boy, was that satisfying. Big old hammered silver. 1500s hammered silver. And that's the way you end the day. Sorry, Lady Liberty. Time to go. Day five is in the books. We're going to go over our bits and bobs. I went for quality, not quantity. You got quantity too. You got, you have both. Mm. I like your old buckle and your little bits. Any good coinage over here? A little bit. More modern half pennies and pennies. That's definitely an older copper. Yeah. There's your should be silver coin of some sort. It's got you know, all your buttons. Nice little button day. And Roman. Most most likely. <laughs> There's nothing else that could be. Mmm. 
No days complete without the D. So I don't know, have confirmation on this. Very crude, could be. A Viking bracelet. A <laughs> Viking bracelet. I'm thinking trigger guard, but who knows. My buttons, including the medieval lead button. Killer. One of my favorite things. A couple more moderns, lead. Maybe little hearts. That's the love token there. Little silver William the Third and a Lizzie. 1566. Welcome to the club. <sighs> the Lizzie Club. Club I'm not in. Congratulations to John on his Lizzie and his other hammer. Until next week, help clean up the ground. Dig it all and take your trash with you. Why? Why? Because all holes matter. <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> and a curse. And a possible Roman. A possible Roman. Call that a curse. That's a good well, <laughs> good luck today, you boys. That guy. <laughs> <laughs> well, I was gonna pop that live, but uh, Nathan just got a hammered. Henry the third. Oh, holy cow! I gotta switch cameras. Sweet. Yeah, it's a beauty. Outstanding. Long. Oh, that's. Is that like voided his long the cross. voided long cross? Yeah, Henry the third. Henry the third. So the thirteen hundreds. Yeah, uh, tw uh, 12, tw uh, 12, 12, 12, 12, 12, Yes. The impression is pretty as the coin. Congratulations, Nathan. Thank you. That's a beaut. It's a way to start the day, huh? Roman and then... <laughs> <laughs> Don't <take that. laughs> I always say, if I can get two coins for the day, I'm happy. Oh, it's early. Congratulations. Thank you. All right, back to my hole. This is where I was. When anything got hammered. Ugh. Sorry, it's in my headphones. The sound. Angle you up a little more. Something there. Oh, there's a big copper. I know it was a good signal. That's good. The coin. And not too sure what we have here, but I think I'm gonna get an ID. Ugh, maybe later. Let her dry out. Big copper. I'm pretty good at digging lead today. What are you gonna do? It's what the earth's been giving me. I, I get high 80s on, on some ticks. Yeah? Let's course, pop that of thing. The last hole of lead did that too, but look at the color right here. Yeah? You liking it? Yeah. Right in the middle. That's not a coin. You said it was gonna be a coin. That's like a hinge, bruh. That's not, oh, what is that? Picture frame hanger? I don't know. It looks it's nice purposely rolled up. Quality old metal, though. Hmm. Mm. Where's Chris when you need him? Uh, oh, there's Chris. Oh, there's Chris. Oh, Picture frame holder yeah, hanger? I don't know. Beautiful. Folded over a piece of junk. Or wire clippers. Oh, oh, what a signal. You know, like a pusher. Best target of the day. Oh, that was satisfying. Perfect mid tone. It was like a 52, 53. Same thing we've been digging all week. And it's hammered silver, baby. Where's Brad? Be red! I don't think he's coming for me. I just have a feel. What you got, buddy? What you got? One of those little things. Look at the impression, man. That is just. Nice to die. He's like, this is a hammy, it's gotta be. Right? Okay, it's an old break, so. It wasn't me. But what is it? Long cross. Oh, good detail, <laughs> it is good detail. Nice. Oh, <sighs> We're supposed to hit another field this morning. It's kind of hard to leave this one. Yep. Oh, I there. just, I it's just, I just wasted my uh, impression. There goes that picture. Too bad she's got a little chunk taken out of it, but. It's gonna be harder to leave now. Yeah. Let me finish cleaning her up. Uh, yep, no silver edge, old break. That was so enjoyable. And now I know what the little ones sound like. And I know I'd never miss that target. Long cross. 12 cannonballs. Not as beautiful as Nathan's, but the feeling of accomplishment. It's just. There's nothing else like it. You were huh. rubbing on something for a while. No, I was playing with it. Yeah. And play with it, you should. You're not going to miss it, dude. This really? is 50, no scratch at all. Four or five inches deep. I actually plugged it, flipped the plug, bop, bop, bop. Question is, how did I miss it yesterday? I was actually <sighs> getting there for a second. 
wasn't meant for you. This one was meant for me. I did that yesterday. <laughs> Nathan's is beautiful. Can you it's show a, you his? Yeah, that's it. This is the long cross. That's the a thir long, 1300s. Yeah. yeah. 13 That was very pleasing again. <laughs> Somebody was scrambling right. their way home. They had the plague and fell out. They're still here, buddy. I don't want to touch Why did I touch it? You gotta touch it. You gotta touch it a little bit. Thanks. Lizzie numbers. Lizzie numbers right around 70. Just in case it's a Lizzie at three inches. Just really like to get something on live dig. So hard. Oh. Be good. Oh, hey. <laughs> That's pretty. A little silver wash button. That's what she is. In a band aid. Stampede! A little change of scenery. We're in with the. Uh, we're working this little footpath. Huge field. And apparently there hasn't been a tour on this field, so we don't know what's gonna come out. They are cute. You just wanna touch one, don't you? You wanna to touch one. He told us not to touch them. So far, Tom back button. Always a good sign. And I have an 80 signal here. 80. That's coming out of the ground. Probably another big old penny. But you never know. Down in there. Huh. One, one ready for that one. I thought it was going to be right there. Should be right here. Deeper than expected. And survey says we have a coin. It's older copper this time. Hmm. Almost looks thick enough to get some details. We'll clean it up. And if I can figure out a, what it is, I'll do a close up. If not, we'll keep going. Big copper. We like those. Johnny Utah from Idaho. <laughs> That's the copper. You did get a copper. Uh, just some, eh, might have a little bit of a bust Shouldn't there. And, uh, oh. That's Roman. I'm just going to let it dry out, huh? Yep. yep. That's a Roman coin. 2,000 year old coin. <laughs> Pretty sick. Pretty crazy. Eh? I have yet to have been Romanized, so congratulations. Thank you. Is that your first? Second. Second. Ugh. I guess I got some catch up to do. Sorry. Catching up to do. Tomato sauce. Tomato sauce. Yeah, tomato yeah. sauce to <laughs> 79, 78. High and tight. Like a coin. Last one was a King George III. One of the 1800s ones. There's another probably copper coin in the hole right here. And survey says, button. What is going on there? Maybe a military button. Is there shank? There is a little smashed. There's like an eagle or bird or something going on there. Chris told me it's a livery button. 1700s to early 1800s. So that's cool. Something different. For what is this? Is it a swan or um, the, is it a bird, eagle? They're generally z zoomorphic in design. Okay. Um, so they say you can get bulls, swans, lion rampant, sometimes a handled in a, a, an arrow. Oh, that's fun. Head or, <laughs> so you get lots of different ones. Once it's tried out, you should be able to see something. Yeah, on it. It, it's, it's coming through. So is, it, is it for identification purposes in the coach houses or stables where the horses are getting swapped over so the rider knows which horse to change with and which rider to change with? Oh, well, thank you. <laughs> I think we're headed back up to where we got the hammered silvers in the other field, but uh, 
I had a banger here. It was kind of on edge, but it was hitting like 91. I didn't live dig it. It might be a cartwheel. It's a big old fat coin. Big old fat coin. I'd love to get a cartwheel. It's got to be what it is. It is. I can see the big fat rim. Cartwheel! <laughs> yeah, it's a cartwheel. Hey, the sun came out too. Awesome. These things are all dated 1797. That's awesome. Big fat rim. King George the <laughs> Third. Big old honker. Won't even fit in a Purdue. Hammer time. Holy cow, man. That's a beautiful little cut, too. It's got nothing on the other side. Nothing. No. I would have looked anyway. Eh. A li little bit more than nothing. Do you have an ID? It's a short cross, by the It's a short cross. Yeah. It's beautiful. I love cut silver. Whew. Congratulations. I said it was like a 40 out of the hole, 42, 43. Yeah. 42, yeah. 44. And that's why we say dig it all. <laughs> that's a tough beat. It was beat. bouncing up to 50. It was like, mm -hmm. 50, it was like almost upgrading it. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Great hit. Oh, that's a, that's a deep button. <laughs> wow. I was coming over here. Might as well. Uh... <laughs> Tom, back. Would you like to see my George? Oh, you got Georgie boy. Yeah. Oh, Georgie. Oh, look, oh, look at the shank. The shankness. Design? Shankness ever. Nothing. Nothing. <laughs> nothing. You get nothing in like it. Oh, that's a good one. Isn't that? With the little little head. Yeah, that's George the Foist. Foist. Is that uh, the last coin since the little tiny coin? Yeah. There's some differentness in there. This button actually makes me very happy. Yeah. Good hit, bro. Yeah. <laughs> wow. What a beautiful day. Day six in the box. Oh, it's going so fast now. <laughs> Here's the take from the day from B Red myself. Not too shabby. Just me. Yep. You got some lead, some pottery. Nice huge tom back button. Piece of shoe buckle frame, part of a bell. That's a really deep farthing in the beginning of the day, and that's no doubt no doubter, King George the First. I got some lead, some muskies, a little heart thing, my buttons, my livery button, got my drawers pulled, that two pence was a banger, I live dug that, the uh, more moderns, two coppers, live dug that one, that's a King's Roof's the third, cartwheel penny, and uh, long cross, hammered silver baby. Where was mine? <sighs> you worked for it, you should have got one. Thank you. Tomorrow. Right. Next week's your day. And until then, help clean up the ground, dig it all, and take your trash with you. Why, Brad? Because all holes matter. Thank you. <laughs>
We all run away. <laughs> England. England. Day seven. We, we're the only two that wake up early because we have multiple children. <laughs> we, we're used to not sleeping. <laughs> yep. Yeah. All right. Well, good luck today, buddy. You as well. We'll see what the day brings. You never know what you the never next know. beep's going to be, do you? Especially over here. It's like, I'm, like I'll be detecting. I'm like, it's like detecting uh, a colonial field. Yeah. Somebody will find a hammered or yeah. Roman. Yeah. <laughs> I'm just like, like oh, what? I'm not in America. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And this morning, we're at a new field that Chris calls Roman Field because uh, his friend Robin found a beautiful fibula brooch and they pulled a couple of the Roman grots, the big coins, the big bronze coins, and they found some handed silver in here as well. Here's my first good signal. It's a 7778. Let's lab dig it. Yeah, that's a good one. Oh no, so far a couple little pieces of lead and uh, some coke. Fun hot rocks. That sound just like hammered silver. That was not deep at all. And a little bit over this way. Uh, it's a more modern coin. Feels good at least to find the coin. If the other side was rolled up, I'd call it a love token. But maybe that's half a love token. <laughs> they didn't like the lady too much. Just gave her half a bend. Yeah. All right. High hopes today. It's not raining yet, but I think it's supposed to. We are in England. Not much for us, but uh, Brandon says he's got a couple nice digs. So I'm intrigued. Check that out. I will check. Yes, you got one of the Georgian toy cannons. Yeah. Oh, Brad found one of these. I found the same one. I found the same mold. I believe yours is larger. Oh. I mean, I don't. I don't mean to brag for you, but <laughs> yours is also yours. shoots faster. So. <laughs> that is awesome, man. <laughs> Sorry, mom. Hey. Yeah. Anything else? Um. So I do have a piece of possibly Saxon. Who? This is a strap end. It would have been on the loose ends of your braided uh, ropes and. Uh, leather bits and pieces. I'm all about that. Yeah. That's yeah, good looking stuff. I'd love to rub on something like that. Mm -hmm. No, not that one. No. He wants to rub on his own. Oh, this ground is bad right here. But I'm thinking a 77, 78 could be anything. I heard something right there. Right in the middle where she should be. Should be a good non ferrous target at least. Be shiny right there right there I have the sound in my, my headphones I see it that's a weird little weight of some sort lead maybe it's a Roman button <laughs> Something to show, mate. Yeah, I've been cursing out coke all day. This is my biggest piece. It's uh, pretty high tone, actually. It's mid 70s, clean. Threw it uh, in my pouch, slammed it shut, cursed it, beeped the hole. Ba, 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 ba. Well, okay, 88, 86, 88. <laughs> so it does pay to dig coke yeah. from time to time. Mm. Yeah, sitting under the coke. Big cup under the coke. Not much for details, but I'm sure that was enjoyable. Yeah, I'll take to a, say the least. Take a G3 or something. <laughs> well, good job. Thank you. I need to get something old. I think it's a cat bust. <laughs> this sounds like a deep copper to me. I've heard a few of them in my day. Now I'll take a silver. Oh yeah, that's good. It's gotta be good now, Ferris. And I said it was deep. And she is. Go fish. Uh, 
Ooh. Just give it to me on the probe. Yep, there it is. Way down there. Right there. Let's go with the little guy. Oh. <laughs> so it sounds like a deep copper and I like it. <laughs> below probe. <laughs> that was enjoyable. Braided hair. <laughs> Braided hair. Good job, mate. Thanks, buddy. Uh, uh, no positive identification. Oh, MPI. Hmm. Big copper. That was that was enjoyable. The jinx is on. Oh, 82, 83. Oh. Just trying to get sat down? Yeah. <laughs> it has gotta be a coin beeping like that, eh? Oh god, it wasn't that. <laughs> Slow like. Ew. That's not it. Nope. It's not it. That's it. That's it. Copper. Copper. Yeah, you Don't. wanted to leave this field, meow. Don't. No, no, no. I didn't say that. Well, what's a it? I don't know, but <laughs> congratulations. Thank you. Oh, there it is. There it is. Huh? Wait. Silly man. It's in New York. <laughs> <laughs> Goodbye. Well, I wasn't expecting this at all. It was a 55 signal, like right on the surface, double tap, and I figured another shotgun shell. There's been a few today. Not a shotgun shell. It looks lead, and I see a shank. Medieval button. Oh, I think it is. Oh my goodness, look at that thing. Let me give this thing a soft brush, and we'll come back. My last one didn't have a shank. This one most certainly does. Look at that huge shank on that thing. Let me clean her up a bit. A little chewy around the edges, but it has a shank. Big old lead button. It's got to be medieval like the one I dug a few days ago or a few episodes ago. Whew. I love it. That is awesome. This is going bad. It's like 50s, 60s. Could most certainly be medieval silver in the hole. Right here. Oh. <laughs> Silverwash wash flat button. That color though. Holy cow, that color though. There it is. And it's round, it's not silver. It might be a really wasted coin. Doesn't feel like a button. Hmm, I guess they had hammered coppers back then too. Hopefully we're on the right track. Definitely a coin. Where are you? Alright. Did it just fall? It did. Another copper? <laughs> That's cool. Looks like an older one. At least. That's suddenly one of them big fat Romans. But I will certainly take another copper. A coin is a coin. I just got the sign that somebody's been hammered on. It might be Brad. I hope it's Brad. He's due. I don't know. Let's go find out. They're still like 200 yards away from me. Ooh. What's it gonna be? <laughs> what is happening? Silver denarii. Seriously? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh my. Oh my. <laughs> Hanging in that. You are a crazy off the... man. Yeah. Can I see it? Yeah, of course. Brother, can I see it? <laughs> Roman Silva! Oh my. <sighs> you. We've just been talking about it. Is that, is that somebody metal detecting on the back? <laughs> Look at that! <laughs> oh my gosh. You've got water to clean it up. Oh man. Oh, 
Well, my foo is up in the. Uh, I got a foo on me. Up here, in the back. Oh, I've got one here. <laughs> oh, yeah. I've never oh. fooed. Oh, with my foo. Oh, yeah, whip that out. <laughs> <laughs> when in Rome. <laughs> hey. Hmm? Oh my god. You didn't do it. Yeah. Oh, you whipped it first. That's, oh, a, that's a double whip. Triple whip. Oh my. Fooing a denarius. <laughs> I was working this area before lunch. I knew I could smell one in here. <laughs> Who did it? Brandon. Nice. He's had a rough couple days. I filmed pretty uh, in Oh, you got it. Today, yeah. <sighs> Is that Roman? Mm-hmm. Are you kidding me? No. Roman silver. It's Roman silver. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I wanted to do. <laughs> I need Roman. You have Roman. You don't have Roman silver. Uh, actually, I do. Okay, you do have Roman silver. <laughs> <sighs> One terribly deep, I see. Good looking plug. That should go back in there nicely. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Roman silver. Looks like a horse on this side. And there's a bus on this side. I guess facing left. Almost looks like it's facing left and right. Yeah. Huge congrats. And then we got the right and the Thanks, buddy. It's awesome, dude. <laughs> That'd be good. Anything else interesting in this area? Some no, lead and oil. Stuff. Same thing. Same stuff we've been digging all day. I got a couple more good. modern things way up on top of the hill. But I was running around looking for one of those. Bring it down here. Get you one. Well. If you insist. <laughs> nice deep high turn here. Oh, that sounds so good. Oh no. This ground is so hard. Ugh. Way down there. Hope it's one of the big bronze ones. Bronze Roman coin. I'm just gonna remove some some dirt because I know it's way down there. Why is there a helicopter messing up my shot? There goes my audio. Alright, for the money shot. For all the money. Ugh, be good. Nope, nothing popped. Oh, oh, whoa, 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 guys, 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 I need help. I need help. What is that? Whoa. Oh, it's, it's a big silver. I don't think it's that old. Easy does it. Let me, let me change cameras. Oh, it's down there. I thought, I thought I was going after like a deep copper. I mean, I thought it was roaming at first, like a huge one. It's silver. That makes me happy. Uh, be somewhat old though. 1915. Why is it so deep? It's twice as deep as his thing. Oh, those oh, are beautiful. Nice. Snap it's uh, 19 something. Oh, whew. That's one of my oh. favorite designs, man. Oh. Cool, man. I thought it was going to be roaming the way it popped out of there, though. <laughs> that was pleasant. It's a flooring. 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 Here's a monarch. Flip over. 1936. That'll be George the fifth, probably. Maybe George is just in the George's head. George fifth, fifth, yeah, five. That was enjoyable. Let me finish cleaning. I'll do a nice close up. It looks in beautiful condition. Thanks, buddy. Old Georgie boy. They told me this is a uh, 50% silver. The reverse is absolutely stunning. Beautiful relief. It's a. Uh, 1936 and it's one florin which is equivalent to like a tenth of a pound which that's a big coin for two shillings or ten pence it was hard not to think big fat Roman after seeing his coin <laughs> and that came up twice as deep if not three times as deep as his but that was enjoyable I brought uh, John Snelly's Tom back button all the way to the UK. Sorry, pal. An accident. He left it in my Purdue. 
Thank Day you. seven in the books. Congratulations to Brandon on your denari, denarius. So if it's a single, it's a the denarius. Silver right. Roman coin. <sighs> Amazing. And uh, here's what Brad and I found. Cow tube? It's called a moo tube. Moo tube. Throws a beautiful signal. Yes, it does. Maybe some pewter spoonage yeah. handle. Get some, some clovers up there some for good five, luck for tomorrow. Five levers. A little uh, little tacky thing there. Mm. Got on a couple buttons and a couple coppers. I'm sure you're KG3s. Those are the top two are like the 1800s KG3s, and you have one of one of the older ones like we find back at home. You see the old chain mail there. I uh, it's my bits and bobs over here. That button had me wrecked through a 90 signal. Oh, is that silver? What is going on? Whoa! Is that a big button? That's different. It's really light. <laughs> I'm leaning more modern. Some little buttons, a time back. I hate it. I got two pieces of medieval though. This is a spindle whirl, I came to find out. It's got a little design on it. And that's a big old lead button. Shank included. This thing right here, I'll show you the video of this coming out of the ground. Roman! And then I cleaned out the backside, and it's a button. <laughs> oh. I actually got an idea on that. That's a William and Mary halfpenny. I've never heard somebody yell Roman. So oh, that was life. bad. And the uh, couple other little coppery things, and that was really fun to find. 10, 11 inches deep. Beautiful silver coin. Florin. One Florin. Oh, excuse me. <sighs> Three days left, buddy. Until. Yep, what? I said we can do it. We can do it. Yep. <laughs> My shoulder, it'll hang in there. We need gold. Oh. Until next week, help clean up the ground, dig it all, and take your trash with you. Why? Because all holes matter. <laughs> that one sounds broken. <laughs> Go find mommy. Yeah, you hear it? Mommy's that way. <laughs> it's like Marco Polo. Get in under there. It's right in the middle. <laughs> you got. Hammer. Hammer foil. If the, if the Roman's six inches, I guess they could be. Okay, well, see you later. <laughs> Big fat penny. <laughs> no. Silver variety. Is that gold? Wait, yeah. Is that gold? Hold Is that, that gold? No, easy, easy. Is that gold? I don't think so. Is that gold? I don't think so. It's a bottle cap. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, God. Ah. <sighs> Ooh. Day eight. Day eight. England. Feels like it. <laughs> <laughs> I yeah. hear that. Whoa. Yeah. Um, this field though. This, yeah. This place. A lot of great stuff come out of this place. And you would think, like, why would you want to come back to a place where stuff has been found? It's because no one ever gets it all. And it's still, yes, sir. Yeah. Let's have some fun, buddy. Everybody's walking towards TJ and. He's laughing. Is it? I was thinking I'm fucking No, no, no.
We've been here like three minutes. No, it, was too fast. Uh, yeah, it was in this. No! <laughs> I mean, yes! <laughs> yeah, yeah. Fine, it is silver, eh? Yeah. All right. Well, way to get Jesus. it done early. Now you're not gonna find any lot of stuff. Any I'm details on it? It looks yeah. kind of. Yeah. There's I'm on just, the backside. I can't complain anymore. Mm. I had all day. I can't complain. <laughs> that sucks. <laughs> he complained all night last night. The whole night, even when he was sleeping. <laughs> <laughs> oh. This field's so oh, rocky. Wait, wait, it was so in a grass it's layer. No, it's no, an eddy. Long cross. Not a bad looking one. Yeah, 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 here's a go. Well, probably <laughs> Three minutes in, congratulations, man. <laughs> Yay! It's a, it's beaut. <laughs> All right, well, I'll see you later. This is a banger, it's right around 80. Yeah. Yeah, it might be a shallow copper. Oh, it's right there. Right there. See something in the green? It is a copper. Uh, I hope it's a Vicky. It is hard to tell. Oh, it's upside down. It's George. Baltimore. Yeah. Huh. Oh, that was enjoyable. Penny. <laughs> it's uh, so hard to get through. It's not even soil, it's just rocks. Oh, what's that? Tom back button? Okay, Tom back. Alright. Yeah, that same color as the silver. Mmm, I can't get any designs on mine. Dang it. Nathan's got a big old coin. <laughs> Cartwheel penny. Deep. Yeah. Eight and a half inches. Nice, you flipper. Let me see George. Yeah. Not bad at all. Mm. <laughs> it's something about a huge coin. Yeah, definitely. Very enjoyable. They have some big coins over here, if you haven't noticed. Very well. So, TJ didn't jinx it too hard. <laughs> 30 second curse. This is like a 58. Yeah, got it narrowed down right now. Come on. I just dug a shotgun shell. Uh. Is that silver? Is that silver thin? Silver thimble! Yeah, absolutely, it's a silver thimble. Awesome. Let me clean it up and do a close up on my other camera. The banging 58. Finally, something good. She's all there. Just smashed. Little design around it. My guess is. Late 1800s. It doesn't look terribly, terribly old, but it's silver. All day, every day. Place time. Yeah, place time. You have good news. Uh, nothing amazing. Uh, uh worth a check in. Yeah. Uh, I think I lost my five leaf clovers. Look at that hammered. Oh, about that wreck you coming out of the hole. I'm not happy about it. It's thin too. This is another little strap adornment. Mm-hmm. Old news, possibly medieval. Yeah, yeah, I got one of those. Uh, this spindle whirl. Yeah, you got a spindle whirl. My feist, big one. Very good. And this uh, is medieval. This has some stuff on it. I don't know mm. what, but it's I got a, a silver thimble. So what? Yeah. What are you doing digging silver thimbles over here? I don't know. Is it pretty or not? It's no, it's not that old. I don't think. It's got some design. Tell me some lines. We're gonna change fields. Okay. Cool. <laughs> Oh, just in case, right? <laughs> <laughs> I thought you were gonna like flip your legs all the way over your head and just land on the other side. And... Oh my god! <laughs> Day eight. Day two. <laughs> that sounds to be a coin. Probably one of the modern pennies. I'll take a Vicky. How about a big old fat Vicky? This field, we hopped in after lunch. We can actually cut plugs. It's not all rocky like the other field. I don't know. Looks like there's some dark stain in here. I 
Yeah, right on it. <laughs> Be a Vicky. Be a Vicky. Oh, it's George. George V. That's cool though. There's coins here at least. So I get a quick date. Looks like 1918. Alrighty. What you playing with over here? Oh, it looks shiny. Yeah? Yeah! 1917 six pounds. Found one a few days ago. Mine was not this nice. George the fifth, maybe? That's a good looking reverse. Just a little 1917 silver. Yeah, line and crown. Yeah. You want to touch it now? I'd be happy with that. You do not look happy at all. Are you okay, <laughs> bud? <laughs> Mootube or a Lizzie? <laughs> One end of the spectrum to the other. Just, oh no, not half a plug. Uh, we'll have to go with it. Didn't cut deep enough. <clears throat> See if I can get the rest of that plug out. Oh, it's because of this thing. The root. Alright. Go fish. It would have been in the middle of the plug if I cut one. Anything? Anybody home? <gasps> Be oh, I thought it was silver. That's all right, though. Looks like a copper with some details. Uh, that's one of the newer ones. Be a Vicky. Think it's old Georgie boy again. Half penny. Yep. You again? Yeah. Not very deep, I see. Silver Roman denarii. Are you kidding me? <laughs> you, is it? <laughs> it is. Yeah, for sure. You can see on, oh. on the other side, if you flip it, um, you can see the lady with I, the scales. I'm pretty sure I can see. Like a bust there. Yeah, maybe. facing towards you. Uh, being hungover is oh. not so bad. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta be kidding me. Like four inches deep? Yeah, man. Yeah, man. Dude. Yeah. Is this your first uh, Roman silver? Today. Or this week, yeah. <laughs> this week, yeah. <laughs> so you found them before. Oh my gosh. Thanks, man. I didn't know they were going to find Roman here. Can I here. do it? Yeah, yeah, who cares? What does this be on the next? Just to make it real, though. <laughs> I, like, I like your style. Oh, yeah. Oh, wow. That's an easy one. Congratulations. Cheerio. Yeah, something's down there. Going for the money pop? <clears throat> Nothing. <laughs> They're finding Roman coins at four inches and I get beer cans, bottle cap. Look at that, freaking bottle cap. It's not fair. That's coming out of the ground. Sounds like a coin. It's only four inches deep, so maybe it's a denarii. <laughs> In my dreams. I'd be geeking and freaking. It's small. Whatever it is, it's really small. Oh no, it's right here on edge. That's why I was beeping funny. Copper. Just another copper that's wasted. Alrighty, on to the next thing. Not sure on this one. It had the right sound. There's definitely a little shiny edge right there. It's probably a tom back, but just in case. Oh, it's not even a button, I don't think. 
No, it's aluminum. <laughs> you. <laughs> no hard of been hitting this field. Same here, brother. You just got hands, didn't you? Yeah. You did. Let me give you a little shot. Shot of the good stuff. Do it. Oh, I knew there was more out here. I touched it with a bandaid. You'll flip it. You little fluffy. I guess you got enough water on there now. <sighs> nice puddle in my hand yeah. there, huh? Right out here in the middle of the Love field. It. That's gotta feel pretty, pretty good, huh? Fine. A little dude. sense of relief. It's been a long day. <laughs> it's been so it's been long. A really long day. Buttons and coppers for yeah. me. Yeah. Can, I, can I hold it? Yeah, go for it, man. I want to touch it. <sighs> I'd be. That'd be stellar. I'd be extremely happy with that. <laughs> I mean, it's worn out, but it's it's hammered silver. Yeah, that's uh, that's an old one. I think that's going to be uh, probably an eddy. So they do still exist. They're still out here. We have like 40 minutes, half an hour. <laughs> Congrats. Find one. So we've been corrected by Chris. It's not a long cross. It's a Scottish hammered. And it looks like that. In the age, medieval. Yeah, um, yeah, definitely. Um, do it. It's a, it's a Alexandra the Third, 1249, 1286. Oh, there we 18. go. So it is a long cross. You were right, but it is a Scottish one. A Scottish long cross. I like the stars on it. That's a good looking coin. Lovely. Yeah. yeah. Perfect 6970 signal, just like a Lizzie. 69. Come on. Be a Lizzie. Be a Lizzie. Not milk. Not, not a moo tube. I have enough moo tubes. I have enough moo tubes. Be a Lizzie. Be a Lizzie. Eh, it looks like a copper. Another copper. Plenty of coppers today. Need me a silver coin. Looks thin like paper. Day eight is a wrap. And you dug way too many tiny buttons to have not one of them been a hammered silver of some sort. <laughs> Congratulations to Brandon and TJ on their hammered silvers and to TJ on his denaria, denarius, denarii. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe day nine, buddy. Maybe yeah. day nine. Look at these little buttons. Yeah. Tombax. You got a, your first spindle whirl. Thanks. That's medieval. Other than that, we were hunting uh, just a regular old home site back at home. A bunch of buttons for me, ton of lead, buckle pieces, 1920 half penny, so that's a weedy. I think both of these would be weedies. <laughs> Two wasted coppers, one ended up being a King George III. I got maybe a spindle whirl and a silver thimble. I'll just say mine's bigger. <laughs> oh, two more days, buddy. Until next week, help clean up the ground, dig it all, and take your trash with you. Why? Because all holes matter. This terrain is awful. It took me forever to get this far. I'm going to turn on now. Just in case it was, yeah, he led. No, that's not fair at all. All that work for that. Ew. Got something out. Hmm. That was fun. Oh, is it this stuff? Yes, no. 80, 82, 81. Could be a little soda. I just haven't seen your face in a while. Could be a copper. I missed me too. <laughs> Let's do one of these. Oh boy. Oh, I see it. I see it. You got the same rubbish as I got. Same stuff. Same stuff. It was up there in the cartwheel numbers. It's, it's a high banger. Yeah. What have I got here? Rock. 
He's square rock. Rock. Oh. oh, what's that? Oh, I don't know, but it looks old, man. What I touched it. <laughs> First. <laughs> be hammered. Be hammered. Be hammered. Shotgun shell. Is that it right there? I'm oh, sorry. I mean, it's, uh, sorry. <laughs> Is this it? This green thing? <laughs> Including can slaw. <laughs> or a moo tube. Yay. It sounds like I'm. Oh, that is not even a coin. A moo tube. <laughs> it's taking my time. Oh, no. Moo tube. Oh. More. Moo tube. <laughs> that looks. Uh, Moo tube. All right, the money pop. Come out of there. Come out of there. Son of a bitch. That's exactly. Just pull out something stupid. Biggest silver rope. Oh, there it is. There it is. Doesn't look like a coin, bro. It's good color, though. It is different color. Is that Roman color? It's green. Be a breastplate. Be a breastplate. <laughs> <laughs> what is it? Oh. A thing. I hate it. Thank you. I hate it so bad. Yeah. Yeah, it's just. I don't like the red breaking off. So, why am I still looking at it? Why are you wasting my time? Because it's your best one from the last day out. <laughs> Sex shot. <laughs> oh, dog. Should have got that the shot. Um, Johnny and I are just hanging out at the castle. Got up this morning a little early. To do some, uh, some shooting. Bit day brisk. nine. Bit brisk. Day nine, buddy. Two yeah. days left in England. Oh. Who knows what the day will hold. Hopefully but we're going to have some fun. That's yeah. all that matters, right, buddy? Absolutely. Let's go. Look at that thing. Medieval. 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 All right, let's go. On this field right next to where there used to be a moated castle. And B to the red is on the board. So this, this old guy right here is a KG-1. It was exactly like this. Straight what do we like down. to say there? <laughs> Straight up and down. Directly out of that. It was a nice target. Any and, deets? Uh, it's, oh, that's yeah, not it's bad. Decent, decent uh, shapes and colors and all that goodness. Nice early copper. Very good. I wonder if this field's been turned since the last time whoever's been in here. Because that's a good sign. Thanks, man. Way to start us up. Day nine was an absolutely gorgeous day. And I decided to have a mental health day. I didn't take any video today. Uh, I got a ton of coppers, bunch of buttons. Brad, I think has Roman. We'll go over that stuff and move on to day 10. <laughs> yeah, what do you want? Nothing. Nothing shiny, that's Here, for sure. Here's the stuff we didn't film today. <clears throat> I dug 23 buttons. Almost double me. Way too many copper coins, and they're all really gross and disgusting. I did get a little tiny spectacle buckle and a William Farthing. There's Brad's buttons. Twelve. And his gumashin. He's got a mouth harp. Yeah. You got some really big coins up here. And uh, the most notable find that we found, or Brad found, piece of a trumpet brooch. That's what it is. Roman, most likely. Frankie. All right. Day 10. Day 10. Absolutely amazing weather. A bluebird day, no threat of rain. The second half of this trip has been incredible weather wise we're back at the field we hit a few times earlier in the week 
where John and I both got Lizzie's and there's been a handful of other smaller hammered silver coins found. <sighs> Let's get to it, day 10. I was not expecting a banger. 81, 82, beautiful sound, nice silver finish. Hopefully it's at least a copper. So far I got one flat button and a rolled up piece of lead. The curse. That's too easy. Come on, baby. Oh. And part of a bull nose ring. Whew. All right, we have begun. Deep in the hole. Oh, good night, that scared me. <sighs> Silver watch flat button. Great beep though, down there. <laughs> Anything? Yeah, I've got, uh, I, I was gritting so hard. So am I. And uh, I got uh, two shot shell casings, uh, like five little 22s, aluminum, little bits of lead. I'm just like- I got a bunch of little bits of lead. Getting on the targets. I have something around here though. What? Hey. Maybe a wasted copper. <laughs> Good Tell something for a Lizzie. Sounded like one. Ah, uh, hammered copper. Nah, just a worn out William and Mary. <laughs> Did you uh, work for it? Was it a tough tone? Oh, it was an easy one. You can play with it if you want. Like we gotta get back to it. The sun's getting high, and then it's gonna. <laughs> this was a 61, 62. That's bigger than I was expecting. Whoa! Big, beautiful Tom back button. Have a shank, have a shank, have a shank. That's a shank. I don't know how we missed that one. I love the big tombacks. All right, still looking for that hammy. Same hole as that tomback button. I slipped back up and got another signal. Flipped this little piece out. This is a little bit higher. Maybe a coin. Feels coiny, but it looks like every other one. Pretty wasted. That's weird. Button and a coin in the same hole. I'm gonna beat this area up. Obviously, we haven't swung over these targets before. It was a deep one. This would be nice because you never know what you're gonna get. The machine just says dig. And I dig. Be a deep silver. Oh, yeah, look at that. That's what I'm talking about. Right on it. Coming out. Uh, uh, oh god, uh, another silver wash button. Oh, that's cool. It's got a dog and a sword or something. That's different. All right, on to the next. Huh, 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 huh. I don't know. Time back button. Come on. Perfect little hammy number. That sound gun was down there too. We had lunch and uh, decided to take one more crack at Hammered Hill. Uh, I forgot my chesty mount, so no more live digs. But TJ got a copper. I've got a couple buttons, and I just had a deep beep here, and it looks like a copper. Not really what we're after, but it was down there, and just like all the other ones. Pretty gross. But it's a coin. Good sign. I'm not focusing for some reason. Hmm. Alright, on to the next. You were working a different field and you came over to show us something, so it's gotta be almighty. Yep. I'll wait for these two. Wait for these two. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Which which field were you at? Uh five copper field. Okay, way up there, huh? Yep. He wants to hold it. I'm scared. I'm scared. I was literally about to give up when. Oh, you! That's in good shape, too. Wow. That is a beautiful long cross. Mm -hmm. Edward the First. Oh, it's gorgeous, man. Good job. Thank you. Was it in the same area where your coppers came from? Or uh, was it up the hill? A little bit higher. <sighs> I was literally. 
I had nothing, no coppers, nothing. Working up the hill? Yeah, a couple of buttons and then <sighs> I went around the back. I laid down for a couple minutes <laughs> and then I said, all right, I'm going to go head back to the boys and I just made one line. Second target was this. Congrats, man. Thank you. I just found a button on the surface. Yeah. <laughs> That's my third button. I got one copper out of here. All right. That's what we're looking for. That's beautiful. Yeah, it is. I just want one more. I think we have like two or three hours left. Please. Last one, I would come over. <sighs> well... I spent an hour and a half wasting my life in that field over there. I just came into the field where Nathan got his hammy. Brandon has something. Ah, oh, my head. No. Oh. Oh. oh, you worked for that one, I, I see. I worked for that one, man. It is rock hard up here, too. Oh, it's shiny. What on the side? William, what, what do you want? Oh, absolutely. Yeah, I can see William. What's the uh, date on that? 1697? 1696. Okay, 1696. So nice. It is milled then. It's a love yeah. token. It's a William. Like mine, but in much better condition. Yeah, it's shiny. Uh, just come out and shine it right now. So it's just like that. You bent up on one side and bent down on the other. That's <laughs> interesting. <laughs> oh, man. Dude, that's awesome. Yeah, it was actually. It was every bit of that. And that took me chipping and chipping and chipping away to try and get out. <laughs> Zero hour is upon us. We got an hour left, so I'm going to get back to work. Congrats. Thanks, man. Your first? Of the day, yeah. First love, love token. First love token, yeah. Actually. Yeah, for sure. That's it. My last star goes a little tiny piece of lead. Digging in England is over. Do we have to do a wrap up? <laughs> I, I didn't metal detect today. <laughs> I, I saw you out there. You're yeah, you're swinging. Right. You got on some buttons, but those time backs were scary. <coughs> oh, what's that? I got a. Little shoe buckle. It's <laughs> my uh, flim flam, some buttons. I love that tom back. You know, a little livery button. And three disgusting coppers. The shot of all the hammered silver from the trip. <laughs> it was a good time, boys. <laughs> it was a good time. <laughs> Very nice, I like it. I like <laughs>